hi to Chaco. This is this is not hi to Chaco. Say hello to hi to banana. That's me. We have a farseer against blade master. Who got the farseer? Farseer is for blade, so that is correct. Okay, that's correct. Okay, let me close my banana suit. Wait, am I invisible? <laughs> Are you guys kidding me? <laughs> Damn it! I'm actually just kind of invisible. It is actually yellow and not green. Maybe I can fix this. Maybe I can make myself a bit more visible. There's a blade master. Can you, uh, can blade master do something cute here? Well, I am fixing my camera. How do I fix my camera? Background camera. Uh, blade master over there. There's a farce here. Some ghouls here harassing. A town is under siege. A town is under siege. I wish there was auto camera. Blade master takes so much damage. These militia they did well defending. They did well. Let's see. Look. Is that fine? This is better, right? Now you can see me. In my uh, full banana power suit. So uh, now we can talk bananas, guys. This is gonna be the full banana finals of the Haiti Chaco Cup. The Blade Master is going for the uh, for the footman. How many mana you used for the Windwalk Chaco? 75, just like normal. Blade Master tries to get the footman. Footman <laughs> retreating. What's the prize money? 30 euros. Be free. Be beautiful. Be like Chaco. Be free. Be beautiful. Be like Viking Cat 91, who just. Uh, a host of me. Yeah, some wolfies. The footman almost dies. There goes the footman. The blade master is doing just fine here. Well, the farseer and the footman and the wolfies. Moving up. Moving up north. Finals best of three or best of five. Best of five, right? Is Does that not say it at the uh, website? Does it say best of three? Let me just check real fast. Info. Oh, it says buy finals best of three. Ooh, this is a problem. This is a problem. This is a problem. Uh, you know, can I decide this? <laughs> it's my cup. But, uh, but yes, uh, a player's forces are under attack. Make it best of five. Well, the farce here and the the wolfies killing a, a ghoul. <laughs> Go best of three, please. Well, do we just make it best of three? Master killing a footman. I mean, it is. What do you guys want? Why make it three? The uh, our farce here in trouble. The farce here is running. Blade Master shows up. Blade Master retreating. Oh, we see some ghouls. I should have checked that. It's like, I should have uh, made sure it was best of five uh, on the website. It's my responsibility for not, you know, doing a good job checking uh, the website. Greenfield is, Greenfield is sad face. Uh, here we get a second random hero here. So many bananas in this matchup. There's a gauntlet, he picks it up. 
Everyone is dead. Yeah, we're gonna do. Uh, let's just do a best of five. Alright. Air statues. Oh, at least we're going with the statues. Beastmaster second. Blade Master, Beastmaster here. There's no expansion here for Blade. He has a panda though. Farseer panda. Pretty strong against ghouls. But against destroyers. So Blade and Lucy is best of five. I will. I will after the game. First troll is going down. Like I can't. I mean, it's uh, it's not like I could talk to the chat anyway, to the players. It's uh, observers, not referees. Blade Master killing this ogre magia, but even if I could, I'd just rather tell it after the game, not distract him during the game. There goes a ghoul. This forced little berserk uh, trapper is uh, so angry. Dome of Duty picked up. 108 critical strike. Have a piggy there. Beastmaster and the piggy and the ghouls. Are under nice breath of fire here on the ogres on the first of warlord and the blade master buys his orb but does he get a third hero no he's going for a uh, cool frenzy and destroyers he has two statues so far he's skeleton over here does it sneak in the uh, human base there's a workshop going up double workshop he expects the destroyers guys that's what he's expecting but he's just creeping here is a farsi level three yet Farseer, he is level 3, he has 2 gloves of haste, he attacks so fast. Blade Master is going for the Farseer. Can I get the Farseer? Farseer is pretty low on hit points. He has a TP, he has boots. Is there mana for Windwalk? There's no mana for Windwalk, but statue block, there's no statue block. Lucifer is just creeping here, no piggy block, no nothing block. I think he could have just blocked the Farseer there, I'm not sure why Lucifer didn't go for it. There's a birdie now, he's in, uh, ensnared. These ghouls in a bit of trouble. What are Blades and Lucy's main races? Well, Blade is a human main race, and Lucy is a undead main race. Kills the footman. Now going for the Beastmaster. The Beastmaster is... Is he in trouble? I mean, uh, not the Beastmaster, Panda. Is he in trouble? No, he's going for the footman first. Does that boots on the Blade Master? The footman taking a lot of damage. Ah. Oh, look at the Naga. We have a Naga here. Farseer, Panda, Naga. What a hero combination. Night Breath of Fire here on these uh, ghouls. These ghouls are taking a lot of damage. And the uh, Farseer is dead. Now we have a level 3 Blade Master. Just kidding, Wolfies. Easy peasy. Beast Master level 3 now as well. This Wolfie over here is gone as well. Breath of Fire. Kills one ghoul, but the Blade Master working on the Naga now. No, Blade Master is pretty low himself. Doesn't have an info potion. Beast Master loaded though. Pretty strong. Here comes some flying machines. <laughs> and the uh, Blade Master just taking flying machines now. Why not? You know, and he kills a peasant. Going for the. Oh, nice 177 critical strike there. And nice uh, another attack. And there goes the Naga. Naga Chan is dead. And you now he's going for the Panda. GG. Lucifer wins the first game. 92% sure he's going Wyvern. Because like every time I've seen Lucifer with Orc, he goes Wyvern. About 92% of the time. So. Do we get a hero here? Do we get the hero here? Yes, we're getting some heroes. We're getting some nice banana heroes. Demon 12, what the fuck? Yeah. Like, it seems like they're just picking uh, hosts that are good for demon. There's a random hero. It could be anyone. Here we have a ha random hero for uh, Lucifer. It could be anyone. Who is it gonna be? Who is it going to be, guys? For Lucifer. Who is it gonna be for Blade? Does anyone, will anyone get Banana Man as their hero? It says literally it can be anyone. Could be Banana Man. Anyone? Could it be Donald Trump? If Donald Trump is your hero, you can get Donald Trump. Yeah. Lucy's gonna get Pitlord. Okay. Well, we have uh, someone here in chat saying it's gonna be a Pitlord. Probably Firelord again. <laughs> I mean, 
Oh yeah, Fire Lord. This is Lucy, of course. Are we gonna see Pit Lord first? Fire Lord? I mean, Blade is gonna Fire Lord. Try oh, what? Blade Master? How many Blade Masters do we see today? I don't know. And the Arc Mage. This is the first Arc Mage we see. Are the heroes correct or incorrect? They are incorrect. I need to switch them around real fast here. Uh, can I do that real fast? Or was that really slow? Well, it was kind of slow, but it's fine. We have an Arc Mage against the Blade Master. It's the Swiss heroes. Orc first human with Swiss heroes. That's what we have. And the Arc Mage is... Uh, here he comes. He's going for the peasants. No, he's not going for the peasants. Blade Master going for the Ogre uh, Magi now. It seems uh, human is still creeping, even though human got the blade master and the orc got the arc mage. It seems orc is still the harassing player, a human is still the creeping player. It doesn't matter what hero they get. It's all about the race, guys. Blade gets blade, lol. <laughs> yeah, he got he gets blade. And this uh, arc mage is he's running uh, around. You know, some water mental, the blade master and the water. Uh, sorry, blade master grunt, grunt and the water mental just killing peasants. There's no expansion going up, Players like, you don't want to go expansion attack. against Orc, or, you know, right? Maybe he was planning to get an expansion, but then he saw Orc and he's like, Ah, eh, you know what? You know what? Maybe I shouldn't go expansion. These water metals as well. Oh, there goes another peasant. There's another peasant over here. How many peasants does he get? 50 ex Okay, he got two peasants already. We'll get a third one here, probably. Or will it be denied? You can deny it with the militia guy. No, no deny. 75 XP now on the Archmage. Wait, is he really? Does he really want this expansion? He wants this expansion, which has been delayed already by so much. Although the tech was here a bit late here for Lucifer, but imagine like uh, I imagine the double beast theory. This is probably one of those games where he does not go Wyvern, but he will go double beast theory, and he could just go Raiders. He might still go Wyvern. You never know with Lucy. But I think Raiders would be really strong here. Here comes the Archmage again with the, the Grunts. He has another Water Elemental. There it is. And let's see how many more peasants he can kill. And how many towers he can kill. Going for the tower with the Archmage and Water Elemental. Water Elemental should probably be Myco. There it is. A bit late. But you know, you know it's fine. Archmage. Hello, Archmage. He has boots. He, you know, he's fine. There, This peasant. Can someone kill this peasant in this one? There, That one went down. That one also dead. 125 XP already on the Archmage. There's five peasants. Blade Master just working on this Grunt. He attacks the water elemental. That's nice. Nice. Now Lucy must prevent Blade to get level 3 Blade Master with his Arc Mage. Uh, I'm not sure. Like It seems like a completely different game with the expansion. Here comes a Grunt. The Arc Mage is taking a lot of damage. I assume that comment was uh, made a long time ago. This grunt is going to be surrounded. No. No. No surround on the grunt. The Archmage is uh, healing up a little bit. We have Ring of Regeneration on the, on the Blade Master. So he's just full hit points. Just permanently. No one no one touches him. Grunt does retreat. Do we see the double beast areas? Yes. And with this position, does it mean Wyvern? Because the Raiders would be stuck. I'm pretty sure, yeah. I guess my prediction was correct at the start, where it was like 92% chance that he goes Wyvern. Well, we'll see Wyvern. Archman is using a clarity. I would prefer Raiders myself, but Lucifer, he likes a Wyvern. Actually, there's not that many towers. It should be fine. The Wyvern are going to be just fine. Blade Master working on this Null Warden. Also, there's no Archmage here with, uh, that can take care of the Wyvern. This Grunty Punty is in trouble. They're nice around there by Blade. Gets us around on the Grunty Punty. The Water Elemental gets his mana, his uh, health drained so fast by the Arcane Tower. Wow, oh, killing peasants. That's killing peasants. 150 XP already. The six, pe six peasants. Blade Master comes back, takes care of the Water Elemental. Two shots or swipes. Ah, 175 XP, that's 7 peasants, just one more peasant, and he's level 2. Here are the wyverns. Here they are. Players forces are under attack. Players forces are under attack. Why is there a blade master in every single game? It's because it's random. That's how it works. That's how random works. He's the one who closest resembles the banana.
Park Mage is level 2 now. 200 XP. And, uh, you know, he's, he's still trying to kill stuff. He's still trying to kill stuff. We have Wyvern. Does he build a second hero here? No. No second hero. 225. Wait. Why does he not get bonus XP? He's a tier 2. And he is a solo hero. But he doesn't get bonus XP. Is this a bug? Is this a bug because of the random hero? Me over here, the footman working on this bureau. They killed one bureau already. Working on the second bureau. They don't have defend. He should probably get defend. The wyvern here are killing the footman too fast when there's no defend. 209 XP, yeah, this is... This is weird. So Archmage should be getting more XP. This footman is at 9 hit points. Blade needs over fire badly. Yeah, that would be nice. For Wyvern now, a just killing these footmen. Do we see the fan yet? Hello, where's the fan? He's getting the fan now. Uh. Mark Mace, he, he's running. He has boots. He should be fine. His expansion. So many peons on the gold mine. Maybe he wants some lumber as well. Archmage. Is doing just fine. Here come the wyvern. So Lucy went wyvern, huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Man, it's always wyvern. Blade Master attacks the Archmage a little bit. You know, just right in his face with his sword. This wyvern is my good back. He killed the other towers, but the arcane tower is still up. Do we see attack at all here for Blade? I want to check, but first I want to see this wyvern sur die. Yeah, over here he's stacking to tier 2, he has a tower up, he does have masonry level 1. This grunt here and the wyvern, they, they can kill so much, They're killing this peasant. The grunt got surrounded here by the footmen that do have defend now, they're a lot harder to kill. Uh, especially since he doesn't have a blade master, he just has an arc mage. And water elementals. He's trying to kill the footmen, they're so hard to kill, he's getting more wyvern though. This wyvern, very long hit points. Maybe we could buy some healing salves and just heal the wyvern. There's nothing that can cancel the healing salve anyway. The footman can't attack air. The blaze master cannot attack air. The wyvern are killing themselves though against the footman. There's a dust. The blade master takes a bit of damage. Where's the healing salve on the on the uh, wyvern? There's no healing salve on the wyvern. This wyvern is back to back. Blade master taking damage. There's healing salve on the archmage and he's trying to run. He will run because he's on a horsey. But the blade master used a windwalk to cancel the healing self. And this grunt against the footman. This wyvern should not be attacking footman if he. <sighs> the wyvern killed himself. This wyvern, uh oh, is also gonna kill himself. No, Lucifer. Lucifer. Yeah, he doesn't attack the footman with this wyvern. Very good play. Very good play there by Lucifer. A player's forces are under attack. <laughs> Surf died. <laughs> Here comes a wyvern. He's gonna make sure these towers are not going up. Hey Chaco, will the Hall Cup be on YouTube later? Um, uh, not the Hall Cup, I think. Just the semi-finals and the finals. 102 critical strike here on the Archmage. For wyvern in the air, the Blade Master attacks the Archmage again. He uses the healing salve on himself. He's so fast on his horsey. This peon is dead. There goes another tower. This wyvern very low on hit points. But he won't get the arcane tower. Archmage is gonna kill some footman. This one. Oh no! He didn't get XP there. Alchemist for Lucifer. Alchemist for Lucifer. Let me fix this. This overlay it is for Lucifer. He has Acid Bomb, so it's pretty good against the footman. Against the annoying footman that kill everything. Against the Blade Master. Imagine Acid Bomb and some Wyvern Focus Fire. The Blade Master can actually be killed. But do we get a second hero here? Not yet. Blade is playing solo hero. He has Dragon Hawks though. Blade's pretty good with Dragon Hawks. He likes to play Dragon Hawks against Undead as well. So yeah, why not just get it against the uh, Orc? Against the Wyvern? Well, there are things called Bat Riders or Raiders, etc. Water Elementals and Alchemist that can also attack air. You know what? Maybe I don't like the Dragon Hawks. <laughs> Oh, there is there's two sh shackles though. 
And the, the dragon hawks do have to retreat. The two heroes, the water metal and the two wyvern are just too strong. They kill the dragon hawk too fast. He's going for this tower. He's going for uh, this uh, tower now over here. There's another dragon hawk. It dies so fast. Arr! Blade master is, you know, is, wants this alchemist. Alchemist does have a speed scroll. Do we have a dragon hawk here? Yeah, there's one dragon hawk here. He should be careful. Dragon hawk chan retreats. Oh, Aquaman's four hit points, speed goal, but he's still going to die. <laughs> Blade Master took a shortcut through the Null Warden and killed the Alchemist. He's totally dead. That Alchemist is so dead. Do we get a second hero yet? No, not yet. And there goes another tower. A Blade Master 123 critical strike. That's a nice critical strike on the water elemental. And he has actually no bonus damage. GG. Lose for GG's out because he cannot deal with these dragon hogs. So he GG's out because I guess he had lost after losing those wyvern. Did he not have a TP? Oh, I have Lucifer. He got human. And Knight of here for Blade. Blade also he got uh, blue. And Lucifer he got gray. The gray Lucifer. Against the blue blade. The blue blade against the gray Lucifer. Reported Twitch chat staff guys you can't report me yet as long as I don't eat any bananas I don't do anything wrong I ate a banana uh, like hi to Chaco ate the bananas before but hi to banana hasn't eaten any bananas yet Monkey tastes awful Not if you're starving Well, we're getting a random hero here. That's for sure for Lucifer. We're getting a random hero here for blade That's also pretty nice Ooh. There's a Moonwall here for Blade. Nice play. He has an Instant of War over here, building Archer. Of course, he wants the, the Murloc and the Assassin ready to... What does it say? Ready to kill. Is that what he says? Ready to kill. I don't know if that's what he says, but let's just imagine that's what he says. Ready to banana. Oh, a Demon Hunt here for Lucifer. And what do we have for our other player? A Warden. Warden versus Demon Hunter. Blade with the Warden. Lucy with the Demon Hunter. Unfortunately for Blade, you cannot uh, dodge the mana burner with the blinks. And Lucifer steals the the Murloc, the Murloc Chan. The assassin is still available for whoever wants it. This archer has to run, but she gets ensnared. And the mana burn on the warden. Can he block the warden with the footman? No way! Why no blocker? Why no block? Here comes the tower rush. Where's the lumber mill? Hello, you're beginning lumber mill. Hello. Hello, Lucifer. Okay, he's just going for arcane towers. Nice. Mana burn right in her face. Another mana burn would be nice. Bananaception. If he eats a monkey the same way he eats a banana. Well, there was another mana burn. She's down to 24 mana. Look at this towers are going up. And this Murloc. Such a great siege unit. There's an archer. He's building more archers. He's built that, what is he building here? Ancient of Ward. Nice play. Nice Ancient of Ward. The Warden's super long hit points. There is a healing fountain over there, but... Woo! The arcane towers are going up. And here comes the Warden with the archers. The Moonwall is down, guys, but we have one more Moonwall. This Moonwall is also going up. What can the Warden do? Even if she drinks some Moonjuice, uh, she's going to get mana burnt. Siding. No! She wanted the Shadow Strike, but she got Mana Burn instead. The Moonball is going down pretty fast, guys. Batman, not nah, burn. <laughs> banana burn? Banana? Banana, nana, mana burn. Oh, oh yeah! Uh, anyway, this Archer is dead. This, this, hunt, this man is still alive. GG! What a game! What a close and uh, exciting game that was. With Lucy at the top right in the gray. Going for a random hero, going for an Ancient of War. At the bottom left we have in the blue uh, blade, going for a random hero. He got undead, well Night of got uh, Lucy. Let's see what we see. The stream is bananas. That's right. Full bananas. Panda banana, banana. Banana haikus. <laughs> We have a hero here in a moment. We have an archer here in a moment. We have a ghoul here in a moment. 
what do we get? Do we get more Blade Masters? We've seen so many Blade Masters. We've seen a lot of Pit Lords, Blade Masters. And uh, that's those are the two heroes we've seen the most of. So let's see what we see here. What do we see here? We see a Ghoul. The ghoul sees the Archer, sees the Ancient of War. Nice Lightning Shield on the Archer. Death Knight. Okay, not very good against that, but sure. We got a Death Knight. Lucio at least knows how to use a Death Knight. Throws a coil. And we have a Blood Mage. I need to switch the heroes around though. Because they're wrong, of course. Can you not move to the right side? Okay, nice. So, can the ghoul... Did the ghoul uh, get some kills? Someone pinged. No. Zero XP on the Blood Mage. Death Knight is 140. This ghoul, of course, cannot be coiled. But the Blood Mage can steal mana. Some, some skeletons. Or does he have siphon mana? Do we see some flame strikes? Or do we see siphon mana? There it is. Steals the mana of the Death Knight. We need some mana to uh, coil creeps and Blood Mages. His wisp is my coat around. One should never go full bananas. Today it's all about going full bananas. Age of War last hit. Oh, Age of War last hit. I see. Well, that's uh, that's just beautiful. The Death Knight, though, maybe he can get a last hit on the Blood Mage. There he gets his mana stolen, uses the coil. Meanwhile, nothing happening over here. And he steals some more mana. This Blood Mage has so much mana. He almost at 400 mana. But this block block on the Blood Mage. So nice there. Uh, of course, Lucifer made a deal with the frogs. And uh, that's why the frog is blocking the Blood Mage again. Look at this frog block. Two times in like two seconds. Lucifer and his frogs, man. It's like Lucifer is like Naruto. And a wisp. I mean, the wisp is not as good as blocking as frogs are, apparently. The death knight does get surrounded. This uh, this ghoul is going down slowly, but he survives, you know. Death knight is surrounded. Is he gonna TP? He does TP. The archers try to get a blood mage, but he has enough hit points. And these archers, they TP with him. What a game, guys. What a game. This blood mage. He should be careful of the frogs. 46 hit points. Let's go for this uh, Renegade Wizard. <laughs> Picks up a nice circlet. Here comes here comes Lucifer with the Death Knight, with the Hunters, with the Archers, and with the Ancient Protector here. Is he staying at Tier 1? No, he is going to Tree of Ages. So this is just, just a diversion. Ancient Protector. Coil on the Blood Mage. He's still alive though. 360 mana, of course. There's not a coil available, but he has over 70 hit points. He will survive the coil. The ghoul, though, dies. Level 2 death knight now. The aura is going to be great. Nighttime. These guys must be healing incredibly fast. Ah, it's actually not that incredibly fast. Another coil here on the blood mage. Banish. He has banished. He banished the skeleton. Banishes the death knight, who doesn't have a TP anymore. There's so many ghouls here. Can he... Wait, how did he have mana for that? Okay, apparently he had enough mana for another coil. Just kills the blood mage. Yeah, why not? Why not just kill the blood mage? If the blood mage is trying to kill you, there's two things you can do. You can run and hide, or you can kill the blood mage. That ghoul went down. This ghoul is also going down too. That ghoul says archer hiding. GG. Lucifer wins the high to Chaco full bananas cup. And he wins the finals. And that's uh That's nice. That's nice. Congratulations to Lucifer. Right. Lucy. And Lucifer wins the High to Chaco full bananas cup. He's and I don't have to eat another banana.